Hello and welcome to my tutorial how to download torrent files. What are uh, torrent files? Well, uh, basically a torrent file is an index file. It's a pointer uh, that indicates to certain content and the content that can be anything that's digital. So, for instance, movies, uh, documentaries, ebooks, uh, software, games, whatever you can find on the internet and that is digital, well, uh, you can download it with uh, a uTorrent uh, file. First, I should ask a disclaimer before we begin. Uh, and the disclaimer is that uh, most of the stuff you will find on the internet is copyright protected. At the moment you start downloading copyright protected content, well then you are breaking the law. So uh, technically it's only legal to download uh, non-copyright uh, protected uh, material or uh, which is also called uh, public domain material. Um, the majority of the stuff you'll find on the internet is copyright protected. So, I advise you to check uh, the legislation in your own country and uh, be aware if you download copyright protected content, uh, you could be prosecuted for uh, doing so. However, uh, if you use u turns uh, I should also add that it will be very difficult for legislators to find you. Uh, they may, however, find you if they really want to. So it's not totally anonymous, but there are so many people uh, downloading and uploading stuff that searching for a, a certain user is like searching for a needle in a haystack. So if you want to continue anyway and uh, download stuff from the internet that's copyright uh, protected, I will show you how to do it. First, we'll start by downloading a, a uTorrent uh, client software. Uh, there are different kinds out uh, there. I found that uTorrent is the best one, by far. Uh, it has little advertisements and it's uh, totally free. You can also uh, upgrade for a small price to the plus uh, version which has uh, less advertisements uh, and it also contains a virus scanner, a converter, a high D player. For the purpose of this tutorial I will work with the free version and you can find it over here. The URL is uh, www.utorrent.com uh, as you can see over here at the top uh, left uh, of your screen. I will not install it because I have it already installed. Uh, if you didn't install it yet, just click this button. It's a program and you install it just like any other program. Okay. Once you have done that, well, the next step would be to find uh, torrent files. Uh, you can do that by using a search uh, machine. And uh, this is a search machine that has been specifically made to search for torrents files. There are several uh, different ones out there. I think this one is the best. Uh, torrents.eu uh, You can see the URL over here at the top left. So T-O-W w r e n t z dot e u how does it work well you just type in the name of what you want to download uh, suppose i want to download a very recent uh, movie which is called uh, guardians of the galaxy which is now playing in uh, theaters i just type it in here in the search uh, box so guardians of the galaxy and I start uh, the search. It will take you less or more time depending on how fast your uh, connection is. Uh, now I'm waiting because my connection is quite slow uh, at this moment. And here it is. Okay, now uh, what's the important stuff to watch out for here on the screen? Uh, depending on your country, you will find uh, several uh, here uh, first, and these are sponsored links. Uh, 
uh, if you uh, click on this file for instance it will take you to a sponsored uh, link and you will have to pay for it so we don't want that we want it downloaded completely free you will have to scroll down a little bit and here you will find several torrent files all containing the movie guardians of the galaxy why are there so many well this is because there are different users uh, who have uploaded uh, the file in different quality settings let's take this one for an example so we have the name of the movie the year it has been released 2014 and this one is in 1080 pixels br rip that means it's a blue uh, ray rip uh, sometimes it's uh, written like this or you can have it full name blu-ray uh, x 2264 uh, that's the encode encoder that has been used so that's not that important and normally the the last thing you'll find on this line here uh, for example yiffy uh, over here that's the user or the release group that has uploaded uh, the file so as you can see there are different release groups play now sparks uh, yiffy uh, sometimes you'll find other names as well on to this uh, what's, what's this uh, that's the rating uh, you can order by rating I'll do that first what does that mean these are people who are already downloaded uh, the file and who found it to be very good so there are five users who rated it uh, five you can uh, sort by date uh, well this file for instance has been uploaded 32 minutes ago it doesn't mean uh, because it's the latest file it will be the best one however uh, when you are downloading software for instance you might want to order by date because normally the latest version uh, the latest date will also give you the latest version of the software uh, you can find all kinds of software on uh, torrents uh, for instance, let's say you want to download a copy of uh, Windows uh, 8. Well, it will give you uh, all uh, possibilities you can have to uh, find a copy of Windows 8. And if you order by date, uh, you can find uh, the latest version. Uh, this is a portable version of Windows. Uh, there are also tutorials about Windows. Uh, so basically you can you can find anything on uh, torrents uh, software uh, games uh, movies whatever but suppose we want to download uh, the movie guardians uh, of the galaxy back to this screen okay so this is a uh, sort by date we can also sort by size which is very important especially if you have uh, not that big of uh, band uh, with uh, speed the larger the file is normally the better the quality the smaller the size file uh, the smaller the quality and the last but not least one is peers which is very important to determine how fast your file will uh, download in this case there are 40,952 people who are downloading the file and 57,528 people who are uploading the file now the more people who are uploading the file that would be the last column over here normally the faster your upload your download speed will be because uTorrent is all about sharing the more people share uh, the faster you can download and if you download uTorrent files and you upload them as well well that's convenient for other people because that way they will also be able to uh, download uh, the files quicker suppose we have made our choice and uh, for this tutorial I want a small uh, size of, of the movie I'll sort by size and if you scroll down well these are smaller and smaller sizes and as you can see down here you have different pages 
suppose I want to have a very small size well then you can go over here <clears throat> now you may ask uh, which kind of size do you need for a good quality movie well suppose you want to have it uh, DVD quality well then you need at least 4.2 uh, or 0.3 gigabytes that's um, pretty much uh, DVD quality if you go lower well then you will get a compressed version you will still be able to watch that in a decent quality on your laptop but if you want to watch it on a big screen LCD TV well then it's better to go for a higher quality because you may get all kinds of artifacts on your uh, video screen but this is only a tutorial so I'll just go for a very small size I have the movie already so uh, I'll just go for the trailer for this instance downloading a trailer of a movie is also not copyright infringement so by downloading this I'm not showing you something illegal so suppose I want to download only the trailer and not the movie itself I click on the file now this may also be confusing to a lot of people because you get a lot of possibilities here each line over here uh, that's uh, a different website uh, where you can download the torrent file depending on the file you have searched for uh, the results over here will be different what is important is uh, to use uh, the same website because that way you get more familiar with the interface and you don't have to search each time on, on the website which button you should click because it can differ uh, from site uh, to site um, a very good quality website I find myself is cat proxy uh, you will also find that some lines have a lock next to it well uh, that's because uh, some countries will block uh, torrent, uh, torrent files and if they have blocked it there's a lock next to it so if you would uh, click this one well you won't be able to reach the website anyway also this may differ from file to file and depending on the country that you're in so for this example I'll take catproxy.com and now it's bringing me to the website which offers the file downloading the file is quite easy you find a button over here and just click download torrent will take a couple of seconds depending on how fast your speed is and now it is downloading the torrent file itself just click on uh, save as you can see over here it's a very small size and this is only the torrent file so it's not the movie itself a torrent file is like an index file it points to something else in this case it's pointing at several people who have the file on their computer and who are sharing it at this moment when you click it and you have uTorrent installed correctly on your PC it will open automatically so that's convenient I'll just wait for a second until uTorrent fully starts up and then I will explain the interface of the program itself uTorrent so that will take uh, a couple of seconds or minutes depending on how many uh, uTorrent files you already downloaded uh, as you can see I've downloaded uh, a huge amount because I'm basically using uTorrent each day okay the interface is ready to go what will you find over here uh, it asks you where you want to download uh, the file I advise you to make different folders for different content for instance make a folder for movies for documentaries for software for games for educational material uh, depending on the content you want to download uh, because I download a lot of movies it already gives me the option to download it uh, straight into my video folder and the movie folder
so that's okay for me if you want to change it just click over here and then you can choose for music series educational that will differ uh, depending on you or you can choose to make a new folder if you can if you click over here this once again is the name of the file uh, mostly this will be an abbreviation or it can be written in full uh, that depends on the file you're downloading important over here is to have this checked or unchecked depending if you want to the turn to start immediately or uh, if you want to wait for instance at night time when you're not uh, using your computer anyway and mostly at night time the speed will be higher too so you can click over here turn start uh, or not start depending on what you want I wanted to start right now for this um, tutorial over here to the right uh, once again we have the name the description over here may differ depending on your language uh, settings uh, you can download uTorrent in different uh, languages so uh, this is a Dutch version so uh, this means name uh, this one uh, is not important this is how large the file is 141 megabytes this is how much space space I have left on my hard disk and uh, this is the date uh, the torrent uh, has been uh, created over here you find uh, the name uh, once more and it has been checked so that means I want to download it so when you once you've checked all these options and you're ready to go just click OK so here we go now this is the actual download starting so over here you'll find the name once again if you have different torrent files downloading at the same time because you can do that as well this will list uh, the number in line uh, in my case this is the uh, eight, 18th torrent which is in line uh, and you can also choose to pause torrents for instance if you check this line alien skin eye candy effects collection that's a plugin uh, software I have paused this uh, for the moment because I wanted to show you uh, for this uh, tutorial uh, actually downloading a file other uh, columns that are important to check is your download speed obviously that will also differ uh, this one uh, means health in Dutch uh, it means uh, how many what's the ratio between people who are downloading the file and uploading it if the four bars are indicated as green it means it's uh, the health is very good so it means your download should be quite fast this is the upload speed uh, this may be confusing to some people uh, but uTorrent works as this it's basically a sharing community so if you only would download stuff well then it wouldn't work uh, it only can work if you are also sharing stuff that you are downloading with other people so in this case my file is already downloading but at the same time I'm uploading to other people that doesn't mean when your uh, upload is complete you should just keep on uploading it you can quit and exit exit the program I advise you to do so because otherwise you will spend a huge amount of bandwidth uh, uploading files and if you have a limited uh, amount of bandwidth well then you would uh, soon run out so once you have downloaded your file uh, be sure to exit uh, uTorrent otherwise you will just keep on uh, uploading the file uh, resterend that's in Dutch and it means uh, how much time it will uh, take before your file is complete and over here we have uh, uh, the column indicating uh, the ratio between uploaders and downloaders in this case it means there are less uploaders than downloaders because the number is be uh, beneath one so that's a ratio uh, why is the ratio important the higher the ratio is well that means the more people who are uploading it and the less people who are downloading it in general the more people who are uploading it the faster your connection will be 
um, this one voltoid up once again that will differ on your language uh, settings that means how many days ago uh, I completed uh, this torrent file as you can see the download is now already 14.6 percent complete and will keep on going just until it's fully uh, finished so that's basically how it uh, works now um, to show you that it actually works I've already prepared um, some folders over here and these are all uh, torrent uh, files so I've made a folder uh, videos for instance and in the folder videos I have concerts documentaries educational movies uh, whatever you can uh, make folders depending on your own taste I like to watch documentaries so I'll go to the documentary uh, folder and these are all uh, documentaries uh, I've downloaded and then it's only a question of uh, clicking uh, the file and depending on the media player you have installed you can uh, watch your documentary right away so if I right click it I have the media player MPC that's media player classic which I can highly recommend so to show you that it works I will open this file and play it for you might take some time because I'm also recording so and this is a, a torrent file and basically you can watch stuff from all over the world uh, documentaries movies uh, also download uh, software I would advise you to be um, rather wary about uh, downloading software because uh, unlike movie files and music files uh, software can contain viruses so the moment you start uh, downloading software with uh, uTorrent I would advise you to install a very decent uh, virus scanner because uh, that's one of the ways that uh, viruses are spread is by uh, software that has been downloaded uh, using uTorrent uh, when you only download uh, videos or movies you won't have that problem because that's just a file it doesn't contain any uh, code whatsoever it's only a file so I was uh, I hope this was uh, helpful to you I'll just show you once more time you turned again as you can see it's still uh, downloading download speed is quite good now suppose you want to stop the download for whatever uh, reason uh, just right click it and go over here stop uh, I won't download this file because I have it already so in that case you are stopping the file and it isn't finished yet it's stuck on 29.6 percent like I told you it's important when you have finished downloading to quit uTorrent otherwise you will just be spending huge amount of bandwidth uploading uh, stuff and how can you stop uTorrent <coughs> you might think you go over here well that will only temporarily uh, minimize uTorrent to stop it completely you have to go over here to the taskbar click on the triangle here you will find the uh, uh, U-Torrent icon right click it and choose uh, exit uh, this is in Dutch Afsluiten and it will once again ask you if you are sure yeah I'm sure and at that point you have completely exited U-Torrent uh, and you are able to uh, watch your files so hope this was uh, helpful to you uh, please be aware that you can use uh, uTorrent to download uh, copyright protected uh, content uh, using uTorrent is quite safe it's very difficult for law enforcement to find users because there are so many users so it's basically like searching for needle in a haystack it doesn't however mean that you're completely anonymous if you use uh, uTorrent so if law enforcement really wants to find you they can however however it would be very difficult so 
please be safe and I hope to see you next time for another tutorial. Thank you for watching. Bye.